Hey guys, today I'm going to do a live reaction to Dragon Ball Super episode 63 and the name of this episode is Don't Disrespect Saiyan Cells, Vegeta's Heroic Battle Begins and that name just gets me hyped just thinking about it, Vegeta's Heroic Battle Begins but I have one issue with that, Vegeta isn't a hero though, he's an anti-hero, he's not exactly all good so that name doesn't fit with Vegeta, I mean like oh well oh well I mean like it, 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 it's heroic I guess, I mean he's saving everyone's ass my boy Vegeta, I'm so excited, I'm so excited to see what this episode has in store. But anyways, before I'll start the video, I have to tell you guys, um, a lot of you have been asking why don't I do the videos on Saturday, even though they come out, now the subtitles are coming up earlier and earlier now. Um, but a lot of you are saying, why don't you do it on Saturdays? Why don't you do it on Saturdays? It's because it comes out at 9.30 on Eastern Time, and my bedtime's at 10 o'clock. And 30 minutes, I mean, yeah, the episode's like about 30 minutes anyways, but, I mean, I have to edit it and render it and usually I fall asleep while that's happening, <laughs> so it's gonna be out on Sundays either way, because it takes a while to render it, it takes like almost like, sometimes it actually takes two hours to render it, which is why I record beforehand, like ahead of time, because it just takes forever to render, I don't know why it just takes forever to render, but anyways, um, that's the whole reason why I don't do them on Saturdays, because it's just so late that I fall asleep anyways, and it just comes out on Saturday anyways. So that's why I've been doing it on Sundays rather than Saturdays or late at night Saturdays, because I fall asleep, it's late at night. I'm also tired, and it, it's, it won't be a fun reaction because I'm tired. I also get very grumpy while I'm tired, so I, it's really not worth doing the live reaction on Saturdays. I'm sorry, guys. I mean, like, I'm sorry that you guys have to wait, but it's it's... It's better quality if I do it on um, Sundays mornings than Saturday nights because they get grumpy. <laughs> it's just me. I'm one of those grumpy people. If you don't let me to, uh, if you don't let me sleep, I I get very grumpy. <laughs> it's just it's just just how I am. But if I wake up early in the morning, I don't care. If you wake me up early in the morning, I really don't care. It's just I'm like okay, it doesn't matter. Uh, it's just late at night when you <laughs> when, when you don't let me sleep. That's my issue. Anyways, also, we finally got to 2K this morning, so thank you guys, I appreciate the support. I still haven't done the 1K special, which was, uh, my girlfriend would, uh, was supposed to do makeup on me. I, we just haven't had time to get, uh, sit down and record it all, so, so I'm sorry guys. I guess now I have to do the 2K special as well, so I have to do the 1K special and the 2K special, we'll probably do it together. I don't know, what do you guys want to do for 2K special? Uh, leave it down in the comment section down below. Um, <coughs> I also did a video... Um, my prediction for this episode, but I'll talk about it while the opening's going on, because, uh, I, anyways, the opening, uh, happens, anyways. This is actually the first time it comes out on Crunchyroll, so I'm excited about that. Um, we finally have it on Crunchyroll, and it, 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 it comes out earlier for that reason, because it comes out on Crunchyroll now, that's why the subtitles comes out, uh, more, more earlier because of that. It comes out, like, an hour after the episode gets released in Japan, I believe it was. Um, anyways, I do, now I can leave the link in the description box below in case you guys want to watch it in your own time, or you can just open up a separate tab so you guys can watch it with me. Um, about my prediction is, my prediction is, uh, Vegeta, well, in the beginning of the episode, we're probably going to see Trunks fight, uh, Black and Zamatsu, because we saw Zamatsu also in there for, like, a little bit, but it was mainly Black, and we saw him use the Gallic Gun! Oh my god, I'm so excited for that as well. Um, anyways... We're going to see Trunks fight him, and then Vegeta's going to go in, and Goku's going to go in back in the future. We also saw Bulma, but I don't know what Bulma's doing. I have no idea, so I didn't talk about that, because I have no idea what Bulma's doing. But what Vegeta's going to do, he's going to distract uh, Black, and he's going to take on Black while Goku's going to use the Mafa Buu, the evil containment wave, and he's going to try to steal Zamatsu, but I feel like he's either going to fail, or uh, he's going to succeed, and Zamatsu breaks out somehow, or something's going to happen where it fails, and then... The whole re that's the whole reason why Goas is Plan B. That's why that's why they added the whole Goas part. But what Goas go what Goas is gonna do is I feel like he's gonna try to kill Zamatsu or convince Zamatsu, and then while doing that he's gonna get killed by Zamatsu, and with his dying breath he's gonna give the Patari rings to Goku and Vegeta, and then while that's happening I'm guessing Zamatsu and Black will fuse, and then Goku and Vegeta will fuse, and then they're gonna use the evil containment wave on. Uh, Black Zamatsu, which I'm gonna call this new form, the whole fusion between the two, Black Zamatsu, and I, I wanted to see if they said anything about Trunks' new transformation. I didn't see anything. Um, I, they, they still haven't given a name for it or anything like that, but in, in that instance when they use it and fuse, I feel they'll succeed then, because it's the only way they can defeat him, because he's immortal. 
Anyways, I do have the details in the video, which I'm going to leave in the description box below. I'm going to leave the link to that video so you guys can watch it. Because I, I put together some details explaining why it's been hinted since like the beginning of Dragon Ball Super and also. Excuse me, guys. Man, I'm excited for this episode because my boy Vegeta! <laughs> Already? Also, in the previous episode for the pre in the preview for this episode in the previous episode, it said that Vegeta trained. So I'm guessing Vegeta trained while Goku was trying to learn the Mafabu. But what kind of training did Vegeta Hyperbolic Time Chamber? Oh shit! When I saw uh, I when I saw the fucking tower, I was like, okay, he used the hyperbolic time chamber. I was like, no way. He destroyed the fucking hyperbolic time chamber. Yo, so he trained for a whole year! He trained for a fucking whole year! Cause it took Goku like, um... No, it just took him a night. It was just night, so it wasn't a full whole year. So it was like 12 hours, so he did it for 6 months, I'm guessing? So he was there for 6 months. I wonder what kind of fucking tra Oh my god, yo, now I'm fucking hype! Now I'm fucking hype, let's go! Oh my god, and there's still the possibility of fusion, because what is Goas going to do other than give him the Batar earrings? There's nothing else. Aww. It looked like she tried kissing him, I think. It was mouth to mouth, like feeding her. Yeah, Jerobi. <laughs> <laughs> he was fantasizing about it. He would be very tragic if those two die. That would be extremely tragic. Excuse me, guys. Not many people are left. She went to take on Black? Yo, she got more balls than any men. There's Black's hideout. Oh, he's excited for that. She's gonna try to snipe him. And, you know, that is a smart move. Cause they- it, she, Well, she doesn't have key. I don't think you can sense the key of just a weak human. But again, shots don't matter on Saiyans cause they're hard-headed. So this is why Trunks was fighting him instead of hiding. I was confused as why he was holding them back. It's because he wanted to protect mine. Cause I felt like Trunks should have just stayed hidden until Goku and Vegeta came back. She only got one shot though. Yo, but she has to shoot Black, not Zamatsu. Because Zabatsu is immortal. Yeah, okay, she, she, I, I was like, about to say, she's going, probably she's going to try to kill Zabatsu, but no, she's going for black. Excuse me. 
Trunks is gonna stop her. That's what. Oh no, she actually hit Black. She missed. She missed. Fucking, she only had one shot. She only had one shot. Trunks is gonna save them though. We already know that. There he is. Yo, Aiden, is he in this? No, he's just in plain old Super Saiyan 2. <laughs> Don't worry, Trunks got this. Trunks got this. There's his new transformation. It essentially, it just looks like he is straight up just going Super Saiyan 2 and then adds God Key to it. Yo, this is one of the most badass scenes in Dragon Ball Super. Just look at this. He's taking on both of them. Yo, I can't wait to play Xenoverse 2. I really am hyped for that game right now. Yo, so now it's a fist fight. Woo! Shit! Get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh my god! Look at that! Whoa, he just destroyed the hideout. It's not really a hideout, though. It's just the place where they hanged out. Oh! Dang! Keep going! Keep going! Yo! Dang, Trunks! Dang! Wow! I mean, <laughs> I mean, <laughs> this definitely surpassed the final flash she did just a few episodes ago. That's definitely something. Zamatsu's still there. Do, 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 do. Excuse me. Oh yeah, I forgot that Goten and Trunks wanted to go. Now this is the part where Trunks has almost no hope. Mine, weren't you supposed to go home? One attack and left. Hey, at least he knows about his stamina. And he's keeping it in the back of his mind. So what's going to be his final move? Is it Masenko? Because we saw Masenko in the preview. Are you going to blow yourself up? Yo, he just pulled a fucking Manja Majita. No trunks. Black. Oh man, not again. Not again. At least trunks got some light. <laughs> <laughs> 
At least he did. I might get bruised. Right on time! Right on time! Act 3. Yo, how many times am I gonna see my boys get freaking stabbed through like it's nothing? Freaking Goku, Vegeta, Trunks, man. Black! Your ass better die. Fucking hate you. <laughs> He's one of the best villains, though, out of Dragon Ball so far. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. It's definitely to say who's the best villain in Dragon Ball Z or in the whole Dragon Ball trilogy. Haha! <laughs> that was kind of comedic, though. The sound he did, he was like, POW! <laughs> <laughs> this will be your grave. We even brought a coffin. <laughs> oh, I love Vegeta. How did Trunks heal from that? There's something. Then again, he is a little half saiyan, so. They fucked up. They fucked up. That's where they fucked up. It's funny because Black's just chit chatting in the back. <laughs> she got a fire extinguisher. Is more our style. Yeah, but then how are you gonna... Okay. There's still the issue of him being immortal. Even Supreme Kai's here. Okay. Yeah, the time ring, alright, I knew that. So he is going to try to convince him. <laughs> is Goasa going to join him though? There's, uh, there's that theory like rolling around. A lot of you have been saying that. I'm like, I don't think so, but that's still a possibility. Wow, so Whis is an angel. So <laughs> I love Goku's logic. So if Beerus dies, then Whis dies as well. So there's that too. So if Gowasu dies, then the God of Destruction there does too. And the angel there does too. Yo! Look at that! Okay. So there is still the possibility of fusion, especially now that Supreme Kai is here. They're still in the Mechie and Dragon Balls. Don't forget about that.
Go home if you're satisfied. But he's still immortal! That's dangerous, though. You have to be careful, because if you die, Beerus dies. <clears throat> I love Supreme Kai. A lot of people hate on Supreme Kai, but I like him. Obviously, that one looks like you. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way I'll lose to the fake you. Yo, straight up the animation of this episode is fucking beautiful. Look at this. So what has six months of training done for you, Vegeta? Have you been able to surpass the Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan? Dang, he managed to block it! Yeah! Bro! Dang! Look at Vegeta with the kick! The classic Vegeta kick. <clears throat> You know, the evil containment wave can still be a thing. They could just seal them up anywhere. They just have to find, like, a pot or something that they can close. And then just use the seal. So it's still a thing. Because I don't see them defeating Zamatsu any other way. Excuse me. So what is Bulma going to do? She made a sp Oh, no. She made a warehouse. Okay. So that's what it was. It was a warehouse. She's always prepared. Dang, Vegeta, you picked the right woman. <laughs> Oh, they're going to try to fix it, aren't they? <laughs> Super good. <laughs> okay, so now my my prediction is Goatsu is still going to live. The reason why I thought Goatsu was going to die is because it was seemingly like if he dies, then it'll lead up to the next arc about choosing a new god of destruction and that stuff. But it looks like he's still going to live. miscalculated to its very cells Whoa! ooh Vegeta Vegeta! Yo, he's pissed off. You killed my wife! You ki You fucking killed my wife! Because you're a fake. I am the Saiyan Prince! Is it over? Dang, that was badass. Vegeta finally got his limelight. Finally, about time. I kind of, I'm kind of starting to like the ending. I, at first I was like unsure about it, but I like it. It's very catchy. This episode was fucking badass.
Jesus. I wonder what's going to happen in the preview. You know what's also funny? That Krillin named his daughter after his first girlfriend. Well, assumingly his first girlfriend because we haven't seen him date anyone else. That's kind of funny. I wonder if 18 knows. Where's, where's Chatsu? Not looking back on it. Where is Chatsu? <clears throat> What's this? What is that? Fusion. There it is. Yo! Yo! Yo, I got goosebumps! Yo! Oh god! Oh god! Whoa! That was godly! The second I saw his costume look like it was uh, Zamatsu's costume, but in black, I was like, that's fusion. But there was some other weird freaky stuff in the freaking opening or in the preview. What was that scythe? What the hell was that? And then what was that little, like, like, it looked like it was like they cut space and time, like a little warp thingy. What was that? So they've been holding back. They have some other stuff, like, up their sleeve. And now they have fusion? Okay, so fusion's definitely a thing. There is no doubt about it. Vegito is coming back. Either Vegito or Gogeta. But, <coughs> excuse me, guys. <coughs> <coughs> Ooh, I'm okay. I'm okay. <coughs> um... Gogeta isn't canon, as I was saying before. <coughs> Sorry, guys. Um, I got too hyped that I, I, I swallowed my freaking saliva into the wrong <coughs> track. <laughs> Alright, I'm sorry, guys. I, I'm okay, I'm okay, I'm okay. Um, so, Fusion's definitely going to be think Goatsu or Supreme Kai is going to give him the Patari earrings. I think it's going to be Goatsu just to make it more meaningful or something like that. for To make him more... <coughs> Uh, like, like, I don't know, just make him still be a thing. Because, like, so far, Goatsu hasn't done anything except for die in two timelines so far. Excuse me, now I'm burping too. Jesus, I'm coughing and burping. <laughs> um, Jesus, wait, let me watch over the freaking preview again. I need to see that. What was that? There was a bunch of shit. Literally a bunch of shit. What was that? I'm gonna watch it over like later on on my own time, but the go oh my god, yo, that looks badass. It looks like it took more towards um, Zamatu's body, but then again, okay, there was the what I now I remember there was like that pink puff. What was that? Like that pink puff? It looked like he used Shadow Clone Jutsu, and that like pink puff was when whenever they destroyed it. You know how the Shadow Clone Jutsu has like that um, <clears throat> a steam cloud after you beat it up. Like, I was like, okay, does he have, like, a Shadow Clone Jutsu technique now? I was like, what? There's There was way more up his sleeve then. But Vegeta, yo, Vegeta, I am the Saiyan Prince, and you have Saiyan cells in you, bro. You just a fake. <laughs> yo, he just dissed out Black like it was nothing. That probably pissed off Black. That's why Black is now trying. He used the whole Shadow Clone Jutsu technique and all this stuff. But... We got to see Black Zamatsu towards the end. The next episode is going to be even more hype. The animation for this episode was fucking flawless. It was flawless. I don't care what you say. Like, the action scenes were one of the best scenes we've seen so far in Dragon Ball Super. I mean, like, before this, like, the other thing that was, like, on par to this, like, was... I'm guessing you could say, like, the Universe Tournament. But then before that, like... All the animations are kind of like half ass done. Um, so now they're getting their shit actually like, like, on, like, freaking fleek. <laughs> oh my god. Um, anyways, I'll stop blabbering. Now I gotta think of a new theory, you know, to match up with this, uh, st with the, the events that happened here. I knew that this was still a possibility. I knew that I, I was correct about Guasu trying to convince Zamatsu, but the reason why I thought that. Uh, Z Zamatsu was going to kill Gowasu is because of, <clears throat> I felt like that was going to lead up to the next arc, 
Like, that was a possibility. That's why I said that. I said that on my video, which I'm going to try to remember to leave the link in the description box below. If I don't, uh, like, spam me until I do. Because <laughs> I do that. I, I, I do forget to put stuff in the description box that I said uh, during the video. Um, anyways, that that was my theory. I, I said that uh, Zamatsu was going to die. But now, it's still a possibility. Everything's still around there. Uh, I thought the containment wave was going to fail or something was going to fail because I felt like there was going to be a plan, plan B for that reason. So... I was correct about that, so, but I mean, like, I did not expect that they were gonna break it like that, I was like, oh shit, that's kind of funny too, <laughs> but now they're gonna fix it, so they're gonna seal the fusion, so uh, everything's still gonna go the same way, they're gonna seal the whole fusion while they're fused, which is gonna be badass, I cannot wait to see Super Saiyan Blue Vegito, man, Super Saiyan Blue Vegito, that, that, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I'm gonna end the video before I start blabbering just forever and ever. Um, if you guys like my reaction, please leave a like. Also, subscribe. Check them out on the channel in the description box below. Also, follow me on social media where I keep guys updated in case anything happens. And I'll see you guys next week with the next episode. Bye, guys.